Hey cuties, how are you all? Hope you all are doing great. So today we are going to do a challenge in which we are going to pick a shit and uh, whatever letter comes, we have to make some DIY starting from that letter. So let's pick a shit. So um, I have picked a shit and uh, let's see which letter comes. So the letter D. Okay, so we have to make some DIYs with the letter D. So now the first DIY we are going to make an origami dolphin so this is a paper origami dolphin and you can copy the steps that i've shown in the video and you have to fold the paper like this but if the steps are not clear or if you are not able to understand then i'll link up detailed video in the description box so you can check out that and in which the steps are um, explained in a detail so now i'm folding this paper and it's really easy and uh, i know dolphins are in a grayish or a bluish color and normally we draw them or make them in blue color but i don't have that blue paper so that's why i'm using this white paper Okay, so it is completed and after drawing its eyes, it's ready and it's the final look. So moving ahead, uh, in the second DIY, I'm going to make a daffodil pencil topper. So I've drawn a daffodil on a paper and now I'm tracing it on a cardboard and uh, you can also like uh, make it's really easy and I have uh, changed the shape of the flower because it was really difficult to cut. This one was also really difficult to cut but yeah so now you have to mark your pencil and cut it in the three pieces something like this. So this rectangular type shape you have to cut it in the three pieces and the two pieces will remain the same. So now you have to glue it something like this. I am using a white glue and uh, to make its border uh, you have to cut the paper something like this and then I am just pasting it and you can see in the video how to paste it because I am not really good at explaining. So yeah, you have to paste it something like this on both of the sides and um, this is how it will look after completion and I have also uh, pasted a drawing on the front side and a white paper on the back side and this is how it looks. It's really cute and super easy to make. So next in the third DIY we are going to make a mini notebook so I am folding this paper in half something like this and next I am folding it something like this so as I told you earlier that I am not really good at explaining so you can see in the video. 
so i have folded it horizontally and now i am folding it vertically so this is how i am folding it and now uh, i have marked the um, edges or the places that i have cut with a pen so you have to cut these lines with a scissor and now i'm cutting these so I uh, then you have after cutting you have to fold it something like this and you can see in the video I'm folding it so all of these DIYs are really easy and you barely need five minutes to do them so you can do it in your study breaks and now to secure it I have pasted uh, transparent uh, tape on uh, one side and uh, now the notebook is ready all we have to do is to make the uh, front cover so this is a pattern paper that we are going to make next so I have uh, I am just folding it like this and then we'll uh, cover the notebook with this something like this so this is um, how you have to do it I'm further decorating it with a pen and I've draw, uh, drawn some lines on the edges and I'm also uh, drawing a bear in the middle so to make it more cuter and uh, after um, decorating the front card cover it's uh, ready and also don't forget to subscribe to my channel because i really need your support and i hope that you will have subscribed to my channel and if you don't have then please subscribe and uh, this is the final look So moving ahead towards the fourth DIY, I am making some pattern papers and uh, for this I am using just some uh, highlighter and all of these uh, pattern papers are really easy to make so in this one I have just drawn some lines vertically and horizontally and it's ready and in this one I have uh, drawn lines but uh, with a highlighter and with a pen and in the last one it means the third one i have just uh, used two colors of highlighters and these came out really aesthetic and really cute and i just love them and um, i am making these small but if you want to make them uh, large then you can use them as your notebook covers decorative papers and bookmarks and this is how they look finally so this was it for this video and if you like this video then don't forget to subscribe to my channel and thanks for watching